I was nine years old when I first mentioned to my mother that I wanted to be a priest. And I continued to marvel at the tug of God upon me over the years. Through coaching and advice of religious sisters in school and our parish priests, I came to realize that there was indeed a call to serve the church as a priest. And even now as a bishop of the Catholic Church. I've never regretted responding to that tug on my heart and soul. And in Mary's words, I have found joy in God my Savior. I wish the same for those of you who are sensing a nudge from the Lord to come work in his vineyard. Don't be afraid to be generous with the Lord. If you feel that tug, there are several ways in which you can explore it further. In my time, we had all kinds of clippings in Catholic periodicals and newspapers with which to send off for vocations literature and find out what certain religious communities were doing in the name of service and ministry. But today we have other avenues such as the internet where you can Google Catholic Church vocations and find there all manner of the religious orders and families that are doing ministry in the church and you can dig deeper in order to find out where you might fit. Also, you can touch base with your diocesan vocations director who is ready and willing to help you explore what seems to be in your mind and heart. Try those avenues, but most especially, get on your knees and do some praying. Our call is sometimes like the young boy Samuel in the Old Testament who hears God's whispers in his heart and soul in the night and he gets up thinking that he's hearing something. And sure enough, that whisper gets a little bit louder and louder as time goes on. I bid you to listen to that whisper. Pray, go to Mass on Sunday, be active in your local parish community. These are the seeding grounds of where you will find a vocation and service to the Lord. God bless you. For information on the priesthood or religious life, Log on to www.ewtn.com slash religious life.